Hello everybody, back live again. It's February 22nd, 2021. 79 degrees Fahrenheit, 26 Celsius in Coral Gables, Miami, Florida. Let me just set up this live stream before we get started. Give me a few seconds. My other live stream ended unexpectedly because the cell phone service is just so bad here. The last one I did was from downtown to the Coconut Grove section of Miami. And now I'll be doing the Coral Gables. Hopefully the service is much better in Coral Gables. It's annoying when the service doesn't really cooperate with you. Everything should be updated now. All right, let's get started. So, I'm at the intersection of Ponce de Leon and Almeria Avenue. Let's walk to the Miracle Mile Coral Gables. So anyway, let me just give you an update of what I've been up to since my live stream disconnected. I'm not exactly sure where it disconnected last time, but basically I rode my scooter up Douglas Road to this section over here. And I even had a bit of trouble coming up Douglas Road because there was a little bit of a section where I ran out of the range of the bird scooter service, so I had to go off to the side one block for for it to re-enter the service area again otherwise the motor wouldn't work the scooter kept beeping and i couldn't go anymore but i parked my scooter over there over there at that corner and after i did that i ate at this restaurant the anthony's cold fried pizza because it was the most convenient I saw they had a good outdoor seating area, the indoor looked nice, so I decided why not let me try some food here and it was really good. I didn't have a pizza, but I had the meatball marinara sandwich and it was delicious. But we are here in a sunny coconut grove right now. The Miracle Mile is only a few blocks north of me. Also, um, I think my sandwich was around 11 bucks, so it wasn't too bad. John PS30 asking, do I have miles left on the scooter? Well, my total trip on the scooter was about four miles for the second trip. And my total trip for that ride was around, I think 11 or 12 bucks for the second trip. So not too bad. It's very similar to uh, the price of a car service. Maybe a little bit less expensive. The 
This is the Coral Gables trolley. These are free to ride, by the way. Gorgon asking if I rented the scooter. Yes, I did. I uh, paid for it with the Bird app. It costs a dollar to unlock the scooter and then 39 cents per minute. And the min minimum charge is $3. Look at this place, Bugatti. Isn't Bugatti the name of a luxury car brand? Also have it on uh, wide angle mode, the whole thing. Simply D Beauty. There's a good authentic Mexican restaurant in Ponce de Leon called Tala Ira. You recommend it. Very nice. Oh, look down there. It says Miracle Theater. So it's Miracle Mile somewhere here. And here's the uh, Cheesecake Factory. Hey, look, there's the bird, the bird scooter. These uh, rental scooters are awesome. I wish they had them in New York City. Here's the Coral Gables trolley. It's actually a bus. It's just designed like a trolley. Simply D Beauty, you think the Miracle Mile's coming up? I think so. Yeah, it's this block over here. The sign is actually labeled Miracle Mile. And what's a Canadian flag doing here? For all you Canadians, what's this all about? Whoa! BAC Florida Bank? What building is this? This building is huge. What's to the left here? Man. Which section of the Miracle Mile is more impressive? I guess uh, let's go to the left first and then go to the right. Copper 29. Here's relax in the back. Is this a massage place? Actually, I'm not even sure. Do they offer massages or do they just sell the chairs? They look like quality chairs. Downtown Coral Gables, Miracle Mile, nice pottery. Miracle building, ooh. Annalisa with five loonies from Niagara Falls, Canada, digging out this morning. Wish you could be in Florida right now. Yeah, there's snow in uh, Niagara Falls, Canada, and also in New York City. Here's the Benihana. Simply the beauty wants me to go to Lejuin Road and turn back. Miracle Mile's not long. Yeah, we're gonna go this way and then go back. Here's Gable's Gem. I mean, Miracle Mile, I guess is only a mile long. Maybe not even. Here's Massage Envy. I guess this is a chain place, Massage Envy. I've seen them all around Florida. 
Not really so much New York. Fratellino Ristorante. Ooh. Looks like fine dining over here. How's the menu at Fratellino? Yeah, salads are a uh, little bit pricey, but I think it's reasonable for the area. Seems like an upscale area to me. The pasta looks like it's at least $14, depending on what you get. Risotto, ooh, they got risotto too, that's awesome. Chicken, steak, your fish. Look at this. This is why Miami is so clean because they have all these cleanup crews getting rid of all the litter. This is the Miracle Theater. Hagen does. Hey, this is an expensive place, Starbucks. You get a drink all decked out, it can cost you more than like 10 bucks for a Starbucks coffee. Let's wait for the light. Annalisa seriously thinking about moving to Florida. Well, it's certainly an option. I think it's safe to cross now. This building is for lease. Yeah, there's a lot of restaurants here. I'm walking to the end of this Miracle Mile on this side, and then I'll walk back the other side. Sounds like a plan to me. We've got some Spanish moss on this tree. This is the Lotus Garden restaurant. Anna saying there's wide sidewalks here. It's very nice. Simply D Beauty even said that the sidewalks here were recently redone. It's beautiful. Here's another area for lease though. Men's warehouse. Get your nice suits here. Here's Merilli. Oop. Might have some issues with the music. Prono Vias, huh?
Finally, they finally switched tracks where the radio, the song ended. But this light's taking forever. Come on, move already, cars. Get out, car driver, blasting the music. I don't want you anyway. All right. Stave, French bakery restaurant. The Leica Art Gallery. Actually, no, it's not an art gallery. It looks like a designer store. Nice bag in the window. Protein coming school, uh, soon. Zero, zero, 0067 John surprised nobody steals those scooters left around. They wouldn't last five minutes in some places of the UK. I mean, I'm sure there's ways to deal with it. They probably have GPS. Well, they definitely have GPS on the scooters because they know exactly where you are to slow down the motor if needed. Well, it looks like I gotta turn around now because this is the, the June Road. And if someone steals it, they'll know exactly where the criminals are. Also in New York City, they have City Bike. That's the rental bike system there and it seems to be working pretty well there. I don't think too many city bikes get stolen. That's a nice house. Here's Bellissima Bridal. Neaton, I've already done a video of Key West. Two, two as a matter of fact, they're already published. There's another one I've yet to publish. And no, I'm not sick of the snow. I can still deal with the snow. It just happened that I planned this trip in the winter time. Ooh, I love these dresses. Maybe some of you are getting ideas for your bridal dress. Here's Peppy Bertini. Groom style experts. So this is the groom section. You can pick up motorcycle here, some jackets. Nice suit. Look at that, huh? Pretty, pretty. And of course, you've got the wellness center here. I thought this was a florist at first from all the flowers outside, but. Veneta Cucine. This looks like a kitchen decorating store. They have fridges, counters, things of that nature. Paris Claire Salon. Ooh, this looks fancy. Very fancy for a hair salon. Another bridal store. And the Belmont Spanish restaurants. Here's the Seasons 62 Fresh Grill. Huh. 
can't really read the font too well. Here's the Thai and Sushi Lounge. Red Coal. Is this even open? Yeah, they're closed. They're closed temporarily due to COVID safety regulations. Please check Instagram page for updates. That's too bad. Look at all the awards they got. They got 2013 Best of Miami, Eat 24. Sad. This is a place for lease. Another bridal shot. Ooh. Gorgeous. Is this area like known for bridal shops? Seems like there's more bridal shops here than restaurants. What place is this? I turn it around. This is Doc B's Fresh Kitchen. There's a Starbucks I saw before. Jose Roca, fine jewelry designs. Another bridal shop? I mean, I guess you can get married in clothing like this. That's right, marry me. You know how you do um, make someone not marry you? You come over here, you tell your future bride or your future husband, hey, meet me at this store. And then you just point at the window, be like, hey. And then they'll be like, no, I'm not marrying you. <laughs> it's the cheapest husband or the cheapest Bride I've ever known. Okay, here's the El Porteño Bodegón Argentino, but it doesn't look like it's open. Laser away. Huh. I've seen this Carrot Express a lot in Miami. I guess it's a chain restaurant. Is it a healthy chain restaurant? Eat healthy and delicious? Carrot Express, huh? Ooh, here's a company I don't know how to pronounce. Le Verite Seke He Tendence. My French is horrible. Jay's Fine Jewelers since 1945. Oh, this isn't a jewelry place. This looks like a. Oh, it's edible arrangements. This is the jewelry store. Ooh, man. That truck's got a loud horn. Looks like there's a store here in Japanese characters. I don't really understand what this says. Yeah, this doesn't even look like it's open. 
AT&T store. Cecilia Wilson. It's your neighborhood. Great. Great to have a local in the neighborhood. Come on. This is a fancy restaurant. The Hillstone. And then we have this crazy looking building up ahead. This was what I was impressed with the first time. You know what? I think the uh, flags here are representative of countries just because they want to display in there. There's a different flag. There's the Canadian flag. There's the Taiwanese flag. And up there, I don't know what flag that is. So it's not just because the Canadian flag I saw there is because there's an embassy there or something. Oh, and there's another flag over here. Oh, and the U.S. flag is over there. This is the Crema Gourmet Espresso Bar. Take out delivery. Avocado toast, open face breakfast sandwich, chocolate chip pancakes. Oh man. Oh, there's more on the other side. Chicken mushroom pasta tuna bowl and prosciutto sandwich oh this is the colonnade building very impressive looking building the colonnade So how much longer does this Miracle Mile go? All right, we still got some time to go. I think it lasts one, two, about four more blocks. This is Kettle. Looks like a furniture store. Ken Continuum's here. You enjoyed your pizza last night. All right. Yeah, I caught your, li your live stream right at the end. I signed on. You're already saying goodbye. Got Panera Bread. The Hatui Cuban style beer. This I got a mute. Brian wonders if there's any more bridal shops. Maybe uh, Curves and Waves is a bridal shop. Let's zoom in. I don't think so. I don't know. Maybe you can get married in a swimsuit. I guess it works. Why not, right? You're free to uh, get married in whatever clothing you feel like. Mia Ku 
cochina. Well, this is new. I've never seen electric scooters in different colors like this before. Is this a bird company or spin or something? Let's see. Yeah, it's all spin. There's an orange one, a light orange one, and a blue one. Uh, more restaurants across the street there. Spy World, Amigo Grill and Company, Malacor, Thai, and Chris Gelato. Evan Smith saying that was a nice Lexus back there. There's a lot of nice cars here. There was even someone who pointed out, no, a few people who pointed out during my live streams yesterday, I passed by at least a $3 million car. It was a red Bugatti, like a limited number of Bugattis were manufactured. So that's what made it so expensive. Ooh. Good song too. Fifty five Miracle Mile here. Some more spin scooters. Oh, another bridal store across the street. Legendary bridal. Oh, and here's David's bridal. But David's bridal, I've heard of before. I think they're a chain uh, place. Simply D Beauty saying I'm almost at the end of the Miracle Mile. Oh yeah, it's right here. This has to be it because they have these archways here with the fountains right at the end. But this is, whoa, this is picturesque right here. I gotta take a picture here because you got the palm trees and that archway and the beautiful blue sky. This is perfect. Ooh. Here's Denny's restaurant and Pollo Tropical over there. Oh shoot. Some bird took a leak. I'm not walking under that tree. There's a Chase Bank on the corner there. It looks like it's decorated for the architecture. It's 
snow does since you're lucky if you get hurt by bird poop seems that way right Liz C saying Miracle Mile is only half a mile long what they should call it the Miracle Half Mile or the uh, oh I see what the name is about Miracle because it's a miracle that it's not a mile long it's only a half mile long I guess it's a half a mile and you can walk it both ways like I did and then it becomes a mile. So maybe that's the way they did it. Let's see, where do I want to go now? Because I thought there would be more to this miracle mile. Uh, maybe I'll just end this video right now on the live stream because I have some stuff I want to do and pack up. Maybe I'll take out for the, um, the sunset cruise later on and record it because I always wanted to do that. Today is going to be my last day in Miami, so I want to enjoy the rest of the day and get back to the hotel. So what I'll do is I'll end this live stream here. It was a quick walk through the Miracle Mile. I thought it'll be longer and we'll be here much longer, but hey, it is what it is. But at least I've been here now, the Coral Gables. I saw what it's about. Seems a lot more bridal shops than restaurants, but it does have beautiful views over here with the palm trees and the archway. And um, yeah, maybe I'll see you on later, maybe tomorrow. But I'll post another video tonight, that's for sure. I'll see you later. Bye-bye, folks. Take care.